always feel like I'm doing great. I don't always feel like I'm doing great. Some moments, like I heard my babies crying this morning. Uh, I, uh, as I was still laying in bed and wishing we had another two hours to lay in bed. And I was picturing a day with two, you know, tired, sickish, young little babies. Uh, and it seemed like a long day and I was feeling panic and feeling anxiety and feeling stress and going, can I do it? And it came down and again, it was New Year's last night and the kitchen was kind of messy and I was stressed out and I had two wiggling babies and I knew uh, we're gonna need extra love and I didn't know how I was gonna handle it or if I was gonna be up for it or if I was the man for it or the human for it. And uh, I kind of pouted for a while and said, I'm gonna just leave the kitchen messy. And that was my strategy. And uh, I kept pouting and I kept pouting and everyone else was asleep and the kitchen was messy and my babies I was trying to entertain, uh, but they were kind of playing with their toys. And I said, okay, let's stop pouting, let's get up, let's uh, clean some of the mess. And I did clean some of the mess and some of the mess became more of the mess and I almost got the counters clean and got the dishwasher going. And I can't, and I said it before in a recent video, I can't tell you how much uh, better cleaning uh, makes me feel. And uh, again, just being productive and getting working, uh, you know, whatever you're doing, uh, getting to it uh, rather than kind of fussing about it. And I talk about eating an elephant one bite at a time all the time. And this morning when I was laying in bed, I was feeling overwhelmed and knew the house would be a mess and knew that the babies needed attention and loving and food and what have you. And it seemed like more than I could handle at that time. Uh, but you know, you get dressed, you get downstairs, you get to whatever you got to do and you go one foot in front of the other and, uh, I don't know, <laughs> I'm feeling good now. So 